Hey guys, welcome back. So today I'm going to be sharing some home decor and some other items, but mainly home decor in this video. I went over to Ross Home Goods. I have um, a couple of items from Amazon and some cute Dollar Tree decor. So I cannot wait to show you guys. Before we get started, I would love it if you hit that subscribe button. If you're not already subscribed, that'll be so, so awesome. Don't forget to turn on your notification bell so that you're always notified whenever I upload a video. All right, now we're gonna start off with, let's do the Amazon goodies because I only have two things to share. The first thing I have is this fabric shaver. I used it on my daughter's jacket and it removed all of the little fuzz balls and like the lint and made it look brand new again. Look at the difference guys. I didn't do the arms because I wanted you guys to really see how well this works. I absolutely love it. It's definitely a must have for me. It comes with these blades on the inside and it's really easy to replace them. You do get replacements as well so that's really good and it's rechargeable so you don't have to worry about batteries. You just charge it up and and um, you'll be good to go. And here is the replacement. It came with two. When it's time to replace your blade, all you have to do is, you know, turn this counterclockwise, pull it off. You just dump out all of the length as well. And then you're just gonna twist the cover off and replace the blade. Just pull it up, put the new one on, put it all back together and it's really easy to use. And you can also use this on your sofa as well. I like to use it on this one here because this is like a um, linen material and sometimes it gets like fuzzy. So I like to just shave it off. Um, there are some on here. I'll do a close up so you guys can see what I'm talking about, but there's like a lot of fuzz coming off of the material. So you can just use this to tackle that, but I really love this. It has an indicator on the back as well. So it lets you know um, when you need to charge it, but yeah, I'll have this stuff linked in the description box, like all of my linkable items, which are gonna be pretty much the Amazon, <laughs> these two Amazon products that I'm gonna show you, everything else you just have to go to the store and try to find. But um, yeah, so I have this and then the next thing I have from Amazon is this speaker here. So this is a Bluetooth speaker, it's by Zamco and you can separate the speakers. It comes with like with this strap to keep it together if you want to do that, but you can always just take that off and separate the speakers. But yeah, it is pretty loud and it's waterproof. You can also connect this with multiple devices. It's really easy to set up as well. Um, all you do is just pair it with your phone pretty much and then it tells you exactly how to pair the speaker so that both are playing at the same time or if you want to just use one speaker then you can. I'm going to turn it on so you guys can actually hear the audio. Baby, I don't gotta love you and you know the reason why. Don't you know where to and I really like that I can use this in different areas of the house. Like if I connect it so that both speakers are playing, I can have one in the bathroom while I'm taking a shower and then the other one in the room when I'm getting ready. So yeah, I really love it. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys my home goods finds now. I picked up some Christmas decor, not a lot. I wasn't trying to do a lot of shopping for Christmas, but these were like really cute items. So I have this stocking holder set of two and it was only $7. So I went ahead and got that. I love that it has this really pretty marble base. And then I picked up these ornaments here. They were $5. I picked up two boxes and this is from the Bella Lux. Um, coastal holiday collection. So for this year, I really want to add a pop of blue on this tree. I used a lot of gold and silver. I did have a navy blue ribbon, but it was so dark it looked black, but I really want to add blue that's going to stand out. Um, I have a flock tree, and when you use golds and silvers on a flock tree, it's not as visible. Like, it doesn't pop because the flocking is just so heavy. Well, on my tree, the flocking is really heavy, so my ornaments really didn't stand out but um this year i do plan to like get more like blues and stuff and i really love the beading on these ornaments i think it looks really pretty and then i have these knobs 
so pretty oh my goodness i really want to get my hands on a second set because i need them for both my nightstands but if i cannot find them then i'll just save them for something else i'm always like switching up the knobs on my um like console tables and stuff like that dressers i like to switch out the knobs because they tend to put really ugly knobs on these pieces so um yeah i'm just gonna hold on to them but hopefully i can find another set so i can use them on my nightstands but it was $14.99, so not a bad price for such pretty knobs. All right, now I'm going to show you guys all of my Ross finds. A lot of you guys know Ross is my favorite store, and I did do a shop with me and Ross to show you guys, like, a lot of the new items in the store. Oh, my goodness, so many cute pieces. But the first thing I have is this pillow. Is it rainy? Oh, wow, it's pouring outside. You might be able to hear it in the camera, but we're going to keep recording. Hopefully, you cannot hear it. But anyways, so I have this yellow pillow for my daughter because she really wants this in her room. But I wanted to show you guys how cute it is. I have two of these in gray. But, um, yeah, so the price is $12.99. I just love this style pillow. I just love it. And then I have this um, flatware set, gold. You guys, this thing was only $14.99 for this really pretty set. I want to do a giveaway, a home decor giveaway when I hit 100K. We're close, so subscribe if you're not subscribed. But yeah, I've been collecting some like really cute items that I want to include in the giveaway, and I just might include this. I really want to decorate the patio and make it look really nice. I think I'm gonna use this on the coffee table that I have out there. I picked up two. I just think it's so pretty, and it was $9.99, so yeah, I have that. And then I picked up this rug. I thought it was really cute. It is a 26 by 54, and I purchased it for the bathroom, but I might use it in the entryway. I'm not sure yet, but I just couldn't leave it in the store. I thought it was so pretty. It is only $14.99. And then I have this really big tray. Love this. I really wanted to get my hands on an oversized tray because I don't have any at all. And I want to use this on my coffee table when I'm doing a simple like setting and not like decorating with a ton of stuff on the top of the table. Just like use this and maybe put some decor inside of here because my coffee table is round and then I just think it'll look really cute, but I can use this in other areas too, like in the kitchen or the island. It's only $18.99 and I'm still searching for some wall art for the dining room and I came across one at Ross. I know you guys can kind of see it. Let me get it. Oh, I almost fell. <laughs> Let me see if I can get it in the frame, but I just think it's so pretty and it's framed only $27.99. I do need to get my hands on three more for the space and that has been a struggle. I cannot find any more at all. I'm going to keep looking though because sometimes Ross tends to restock up on these like paintings. So I'm going to keep looking. Um, if I cannot find more, I'm still going to keep it. I have no plans on returning this because it's so pretty and I can use it somewhere else, but I really want to use it in the dining room. And while we're talking about the dining room, let me take you guys over there because I did find a really nice bench at Rawls. I might return it because it's not the exact shade as the rest of my chairs, but let me show you guys what I'm talking about. Now on camera, it kind of looks like they're the same shade of gray, but... Trust me, it's not. This one is a tad bit lighter, um, but it's velvet, so the material is the same. You can kind of tell at this angle, you can tell the difference. It's not too bad, it's not that big of a deal. You know, if it wasn't for the nail heads, I would keep it. It doesn't look neat the way they have them on here, especially for this to be just like one row of nail heads. You would think it would look neater, but in order to secure the trim, they had to use individual nail heads in certain areas. So you can see here, this is an individual nail head because it sticks out more just like the nail heads over there. And the rest of them are like flat. I don't know if you guys can even tell on camera, but I can tell just looking at it. So it makes it look kind of tacky. And that's the thing I don't like about these strip nail heads because you have to use a regular nail head in order to secure this strip on here. Because if you remove this nail head, the individual nail head, there's gonna be a flat one with a hole in the middle. 
So you can't even like just glue it on here, but that would be tacky too. But don't get me wrong, it is a really nice bench. It's beautiful, but it just doesn't look good next to these chairs with the individual nail heads. I've had this bench for about a week and I'm just trying to let it grow on me, but it's not working. And for $69.99, I do think that is a really good price for this product. It's definitely worth the price. It's just not pairing well with my chairs. So I'm going to go ahead and return it. The last thing I have to share are my Dollar Tree finds. And I came across some really cute stuff at Dollar Tree. I haven't done a Dollar Tree haul in such a long time. I used to do them all the time, these huge Dollar Tree hauls. But to be honest with you, I'm just not finding a lot of good stuff at Dollar Tree that's worth sharing <laughs> like I haven't been lucky at all even before moving here to Florida um, the Virginia locations they were starting to really suck so I wasn't coming across enough items but I did come across a few look pieces that I thought was super cute so I have these really cute decor pieces here and I thought this was a nice find for Dollar Tree they are pretty thin so it's not like you know anything that you're gonna see at home goods or even rows because these are super thin you can use it to um, decorate your bookcase or even your coffee table um, a desk I, I just think they're really cute so I went ahead and picked up two and then I came across some storage containers I picked up two but this is my first time seeing this style I have something like this but they have dividers but I wanted to just get this one because you know you don't have any like dividers in the way and I can just use these for like nail polish I do need to actually organize my nail polish I just thought about that but um yeah I'm definitely going to use these to organize my nail polish all right and the last thing I have for from Dollar Tree are these collapsible storage bins and I did put one together <laughs> so you guys can see what it looks like so cute they have more colors as well but I really love the gray with the gold now these are pretty thin so I don't recommend you guys fill it with a ton of heavy stuff um, and it can easily lose its shape as well so just keep that in mind all right so that's gonna be it for this video guys I hope you enjoyed watching if you did give me a thumbs up and like I said in the beginning if you're not already subscribed I would love it if you do so that'd be so so awesome and I'll see you in the next one bye guys